Hi there, we're still in Miami. So as you saw in the last episode, we ran an amazing boot camp uh, for the guys over here and the guys who are gonna be joining our company. And right now, we are going straight in the area. It is 3.20 p.m., which means we have about two and a half hours left of daylight. Thank you, government. Um, and we're gonna go ahead and try to find a couple quick deals. So you're gonna be with us in area in three, two, and one. It's uh, Real Sales Dynamics. Yeah. Real it's dynamics. a solar one. It's a solar one, yeah. Yeah, we're actually doing solar for Jacqueline. So we're gonna meet back up with her right now because we're gonna have to do a roof too. Oh, okay, okay. This one and the, the concrete roof. You live over here? Yeah, 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 I stay. Cool. Uh, yeah. Okay, awesome, man. I'm Carlos, good to meet you, man. Nice to meet you guys, man. Sweet, yeah. Nice to meet you guys. Nice to meet you. Yes, sir, yes, sir. Good to nice meet you. Meet you. All right. Right. Have a good day, man. Yeah. They sold this house yesterday, uh, last night. And when I was building out the proposal, I accidentally built on that house. And I was like, these sun hours are amazing. I was like, I need to talk to this person. <laughs> I, was like, I was like, this is nuts. You're getting like California sun hours. I'll uh, we'll send a Spanish rep to go over there to get him a new roof and solar. Good. Oh, I already got a guy over there. Um, he said that he already talked to some solar guys. They, they, um, he said that it didn't make sense because he had to pay for two bills. So I'm like, you know, it's now this time it's totally different. It's not gonna be like that. Let me just see if you qualify. Okay. First, and and uh, I'll be back in a in a little while. You know. It's a little while right now. He's he's right there. Okay, let me so park. I, I have the okay. I think we're good. Okay, let me take a look at the bill real quick. Mm -hmm. All right. So. And he had the bill right there in his porch. Yeah, he was sitting with the bill. He was sitting with the bill. He was contemplating his bill. I love that. Okay, so he's using 1,800 kilowatts. A year, I mean a month, times 12. It's so about 21,600 kilowatts a year. All right, so current rate plan. This guy's name is Die. Guy? Die. Die. <laughs> like to die. Right. Kind of sad. On this lead? Yeah. Um, so he was just sitting on his porch. I just got lucky that he was looking at he the bill at that exact he moment. Did, um, I told him, it. hey, I I'm just here. You know, making friends and just showing the neighbors how, how they can save money on their yeah, electric so bill. That chill like that, huh? Yeah. Oh, I didn't see you. I thought you were going inside. What's happening? Hey, my name's Carlos. Good to meet you. What is it? How do I pronounce your first name, by the way? My name? Yeah. It's Mr. Mr. Okay. Yeah, that's okay. So, um, I just need to take take a look at the electrical. Had you guys looked into solar before? No. No, you guys hadn't? So, I, I, don't, I don't need to do it anyway. Why is that? Because I don't need to do it. Well, I, yeah, I'm not trying to force anyone to do anything. Okay. Have you actually gotten numbers back before? Was it? Have you gotten numbers back before? No. You haven't? Okay. Well, I actually pulled up your bill. Let me show you something real quick. So, this is a design I wrote it for the house. Now, obviously, I need, still need to check the electrical for your home. About how much are you spending for your electric right now? I tell you, right now, I got my bill coming two, two twenty-two. Two twenty-two, and that was a lower one because you had some higher summer months ones as well, right? I got someone high, so I don't know where I put it because I just come from the work. I don't know exactly where I put it. Yeah, Andres, can you grab that for me real quick? You had a picture of that, of that bar graph. But instead of you spending, you know, 222 to 350, which is just going to go up, up, and up, and up, because your average bill right now is 310, you spend 194, and that's it. So let me show you. I need to go to the FBM. No. So if you, if you overproduce on your system, uh -huh. that eliminates the grid charge with FPL. That's why you end up with a negative statement with FPL. 78, what, 78? Negative $78. Well, right? So do not pay. You don't pay. Why you don't pay? Why because you don't you're pay? producing more power than the systems than the systems actually generating. So that's that's the whole idea. So essentially, here you go. What happens is, right? We pop up the panels. Do you know how solar works? I don't know. Okay, that's fair. Most people don't. So from 8 a.m. to 3 p.m., you're going to produce all the power you need during the day. But you guys use your power like this throughout the night, throughout the morning, all that stuff. So all the power you don't go use goes to FPL, and then you get a credit back, and that covers you at nighttime. So as long as we can cover 100% of your current electricity, you get no bill with FPL. You just have the $194, and that's it. And we warranty the roof for 25 years. How old is the roof, by the way? I just bought a roof right now. I okay. Just it. it looks great. Just a like, yeah. I just bought it. I got a month. Okay. Yes, I, I okay, fantastic. Well, oh, 
Oh, how long did he wait until you got a new roof? Was it like, was it 15 years old and then he finally got a new roof? I think uh, 16 years. It was 16 well, I got, years? I got a new roof. Okay, was it your insurance company that made you get the new roof or was it just, no, no, it was I time for a change? I do it by myself. yourself, good man. Okay, so we placed the panels on the roof. After we do the installation, we have a 25 year roof penetration warranty. What happens is, is that for your house, it's now protected in the case of a hurricane and it protects that nice new roof. I'll show you real quick. This is actually what happened after a hurricane. This is after Irma. See the area where the panels are, the roof's fine. The areas where they weren't, boom, it rips it right off. This is why, my family's from Puerto Rico, this is why every house over there is going solar right now. It's because it actually retrofits the home and protects them in those cases. But if you go, after we're done here, and you go buy an electric car, and you start using way more electricity than you're using right now, then you can get a bill with FPL, right? So it's just, if you, don't, if you only use the amount you're using right now, you're fine. But if you do some, you know, grow, uh, decide to do a grow up in the back of, back of your house using much electricity, if you decide to get an electric car, then you end up with a double bill. Does that make sense? Yeah. Right? So, on my end, my job's really simple. I will have to check that electrical. And then the second thing is basically just check out for, for eligibility and getting that through. If they can fund the project, which is awesome, then we install the project. You're now looking at 194 bucks a month. That's it for your power instead of, you know, 300 to 350 bucks. So what up when I need to wait? No, you don't have to wait because, well, let, let, me, let me explain real quick. I need to wait, so well, I, got, I, I, I got to deal with the spectrum. I, I, I understand you need to deal with okay. the spectrum. I don't I, have panels, and I'm also letting you know, okay, I don't okay. have panels in the back of my car. I this, that, yeah, so this I is good. with the spectrum. After the spectrum finish, I'm be okay. Right now, I can't do nothing. No, of course, and, okay. and I'm not installing anything right now. So what I'm letting you know is, this is gonna be a two to three month process. Okay. You're gonna get that solved within the next two or three months. So. All we're doing right now is just checking for the eligibility to make sure that goes through. If that's good to go, um, the, the site inspection doesn't care about that inspector, right? This is just more a matter of making sure, um, checking underneath the attic trusses for any termite damage, things like that, yeah. which I'm sure is fine there. And then secondarily is the electric. Can we go see that? Is that on that side? No, it's in, in the back of the day. Okay, how do we get over there? Because I seem to see if it's 150 or 200. 200, perfect. Um, I just need to check on the eligibility side real quick. Do you have a spot we could sit down? Was it? Do you have a spot we could sit down? No, because I need to go somewhere right now. I can't stay too long here. I need to go somewhere. I just come from two week. I need to work back again. So You're going to go to Chefin? Yeah. I need to okay, go to so work. that's not a costume? That's what you actually do for work? No. Where do you work at? I work in the, be uh, I work in the beach. At the beach? Yeah. Wait, Miami Beach. Miami Beach? Nah. How far is that drive? Was it? How far is that drive from here? <laughs> it's, it's, at, on a Saturday, you're gonna be. It's gonna take you an hour. No, no. I wake up uh, maybe two times. I wake in the morning. I need to wake night time again tonight. Got it. When are you heading out? So I need to leave at about two for for something to to start about six. six. Please, you guys start at six. Six, yeah. Okay. So I'm gonna let you know this this whole thing is gonna take like ten. So minutes. Give, me, give me give me give me your phone, boy. I, I give you a call. So I can't stay too long because I. Well, I I, I understand you can't stay too so long, I and I can, I can literally check the eligibility in one second. It was. These were the two on title. Is La Bicea? Was it? These were the, these were what showed up on title. Uh-huh. Is it, uh, last name is Solange? No no, 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 no. I see, I can't wait, let's too long right now because I need to I, go, I, I need to go no, I, to, to, to eat something to I, go back I know. to wake. So I, anyway, you, you, you come, give me your phone number, I give you a call or you come back. I well, I yeah, I, and I, I know, I'm going to come back. The one thing I was going to check on is the eligibility and then I'm going to come back, um, your your schedule is later at night and then earlier in the day. No. So what is what does Sundays look like? My tomorrow I'm be, I'm be, I'm be off tomorrow. So tomorrow I'm not home because I'm going to cheat tomorrow morning. Okay. And your last name is Carobert? No, 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 no. My name. Is... <laughs> what? What? Uh, that's what I'm confused. This is this is what showed up on title. Listen, listen. Is that wrong? Listen, 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 listen. I can't ask, I can't talk to you right now because I need to go. I know. So I'm, you come, I know. This you is come, the, this is the last. This is the last question I'm asking. It was, was that's why I was confused. That, that's, that's, what, that's not me. The, the, that's that's my, neither of you, right? No, no, no. That's not me. That's not me. Okay, but you're on title for the home. Was it? Yeah, that's what. That's what showed up on on title for the house. This name? Yeah. No. That's wrong, right? That's why I was confused. That's right. No. That's right. That's How long have you owned the house? 20, 24, 25 years. You've owned the, you own the house for, for 25 years? Yeah. Yeah, let me see real quick. Uh, 
Uh, are you? Uh, what's what's the phone number? Three o five. So if you, if you want to come back, come back. Right now I can't do nothing anyway. Okay, I'm done. Okay. Okay. But just last question. So if we can get your bill down to one ninety four, though. You say what? Move, move, if, 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 yeah. So not right now. You say when you put panel. Now you know the panel yet. Oh, I can do it right now. Yeah. Okay. We got to put the panels up All first. All right. So 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 I tell you, I need to pass my inspection before yeah. you do it. Before we put the panels, of you course. Listen to me, okay? You you yeah. you, you do give me favor. Do yeah. You make that. I pay you every month, so you don't need to force me to do anything right now. No, I'm not forcing you to do anything. Okay, you don't yeah. force me to do anything right now. So when I'm being ready, I let you know. So when you have the time, you come back again. So right now, I can. Okay, perfect. Okay? Hey, it was All a good right. chat with you, brother. Take so care. so uh, tomorrow, I'm walk out this way, right? Okay, so, yeah. so, so tomorrow, I'm going to give you a call middle of the day so we can schedule out a time and figure out everything because no. I can do most of it via phone. No problem. Okay. okay. No problem, sir. All right, my friend. Okay. It was wonderful chatting with you. Okay, no problem. Thank you. Okay. Well, no. And in those rare cases, that's when you just go, bitch. Look, you're spending 400 bucks a month, now you're gonna spend this amount of money. What do you wanna do? Mm -hmm. And then you just kinda of reinforce from there and really stick it into them, All right? So good job on the lead. Obviously, right. you said it 15 minutes ago and the guy was literally on the way out, but we set up good expectations. I think we should be able to get that one done. Mm -hmm. uh, like, confirm that she wants to do it 100%? I mean, she- No, no, not 100%, just that like, she wants to meet. Yeah, yeah, she does, she does. She said she'd be down right now? husband is gonna be there too. At what time? Um, before, like at five. At five? Mm -hmm. Okay, that's, that's an appointment. Okay, great. Okay. Andres, look at you. We're gonna get you rich. I'm gonna make you rich. Gotta love Miami. It's a good place. I love rough people who are I'm like I like really, really aggressive customers who aren't nice. Because then you don't get any of that fake. Come by sure. later. Breaking. We're gonna be interrupting this broadcast for just one moment because guys, we did it. Since we started this channel, I've been getting submissions for the last couple years trying to get an installer who actually works in Miami. The problem is that it's been taking three to six months in order to get installations there. Not anymore. You see, we've cracked the code. We found an installation company who can manage to get installs in Miami Gardens in three weeks and then you get paid, most importantly. Of course, while taking care of the people in those lovely communities. If you're interested, if you're in those areas, if you're a trained closer, most importantly, click down in the submission form below. Let us know that you're in South Florida and that you need our help. We are there to help you guys out. Okay, so where's where's that other one? And they produce, produce a nice little system. It has LiDAR, radiance, and everything else. Um, out here, you're pretty much every system, you're maxing out the roof. Okay. Okay, cool. All right, and then if we had better reception right now, it's quicker. But then you can go to, you can do a loan or you can do a lease. Let's go sell a whale. 17.82 kilowatt system. Really good. Good shit, brother. That guy? That's the type of stuff I'm trying to teach you guys out here, mm -hmm. which is really intense push in, don't get bullied sales. Because that's the way they're going to sell a man. Right? It's not like, yeah, let's make an appointment, let's do this. They'll blow you off 16 times. You gotta get it done right then and there. And push it as hard as you can in order to get in order to get that sign up. They can call it pushy all they want, but they all push your personalities. Everyone's like that over there. So you gotta match that energy, which is just a lot of intensity. As soon as I got to that door, the guy was like, no, 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 but I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna do it. I was like, yeah, you are. Like, you just kept going. Like, yeah, I was like, nah, really? yeah, nah, you, you are, you are. I'm gonna save you a lot. I'm gonna save you a lot of money at like this. Like this guy really wants to help me out and he really wants to help me understand this. And so having that negative FPL bill is huge and just push, barrel through the objections. It's not even like, yeah, it's okay. It's like, no, nah, mm -mm. and then you keep moving forward. Oh, we can park right over here. I am here with uh, Andres, who already scored his one appointment a little bit earlier today. He's got about 10 just in his first week out here in Miami. Let's get some more, brother. This is just the beginning. There's more coming. Let's more get it, man. More coming. There's this extra energy that you get. Oh, and uh, I, sometimes I see you with a drone uh, also. With a drone, uh, how do you use it? It's, um, yeah, so, so the best way to understand it is it, it's like pomp and circumstance is what I always use, but that's the wrong phrase for it. But it's like bread and circuses. Like, it gets them really excited. And they're like, oh wow, this is a cool drone. And then we can kind of see the roof and stuff. Mm -hmm. And I can actually do a, a bit of an inspection prior to, to the install, right? Because if it turns out like, they're like, my roof's new, I'm taking a look at it and I'm like, mm -hmm. no, there's a lot of debris here. There's a lot of other issues I can see. Mm -hmm. um, then I'm gonna try to pitch them on getting a re-roof because I'm not gonna try to install a customer who obviously needs a re-roof done. So it's part of the inspection. Um, once you get your first uh, five closes, we just send you a drone. 
If you get a roof, right? If you're gonna get a new roof, and a guy comes out, and he just walks into your house and doesn't even bother looking at the roof, would you trust that man? No. Nope. No. If a guy says you need a new fridge, and he doesn't open up the door, are you gonna trust that man? No. No. Nope. So if I'm gonna go into explaining electricity and a bunch of other things regarding his house and do an extraction project on his roof, mm -hmm. I'm gonna go check that roof out. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah, please. Yeah, please. Hay otro panel eh, en la casa. A sub panel? Dentro hay otro. Sub panel. Sí. Okay. Dentro hay otro. Yeah. yeah. We'll check that one too. Okay. So it looks like you guys, your last utility bill was 469 bucks mm -hmm. for the on the house. Yeah, for the bill. Yeah, yeah. And then when I pulled up the panels, I'm gonna double check the numbers, but it looks like we're able to lower the electricity bill by about 200 dollars a month, yeah. which is pretty significant. We can bring it over. Yeah, Hi, it's Hi, Carlos. Nice to meet you. My wife. Hi. He said like he take a look on the roof, or just you you wanna? Yeah, yeah. So I was just I just did some drone shots for the roof real quick. Nice. Which the. Do you have to go upstairs? No, yeah. yeah. I used to have to do that. I did that in Arizona. Awful. It's like 130 it degrees when you go to the top. We have a dog. I don't know if you're... We already met him. He ah, tried okay. to eat our he's drone. He's friendly, but he's yeah. tough. Yeah. Got it. Okay. So I got the photos I needed. Is there a spot we could all sit real quick? I just need to work on my yeah. iPad for a little bit. Okay. Absolutely well. Thank you. Okay. Yeah. $2,000. Yeah. And that's just for the battery. <laughs> that's not including everything else, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So they're, they're, they're pretty expensive for right yeah. now. Um, so overall, if you're worried about power outages, mm -hmm. just go ahead and get a backup generator. And, and okay. yeah. if, you're, if you're not worried about it, that's just in case we've of done, But you know, once the power is gone, we get desperate. Like, oh my God. So yeah. what is going to happen next? I, I usually call the PL yeah. yeah. and they tell me, hey, by this time it's going to be. What was that? Like a season? No. Like, a like usually when the power is gone. You call them, they say, hey, it's going to be fixed by 6 p.m., just so. Yeah. So that's why I'm so It'll be the, the same thing. It'll be the same, right? Because you're just connected to the grid. So the, the, the system has a, has a transfer switch. So what happens is if the power comes back on, boom, it immediately turns back on. It's not going to be done. Okay. 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 So yeah. you have tree shading, you have tree shading, it's fine, right? But if the trees right. really start growing, it's are overtaking that area, make sure you keep the trees trimmed back. Um, utility services, so again, we take care of um, all of the interconnection with FPL, so you don't have to take care of that. Okay. And all the tier two insurance. Your driver's license, real quick. Sure, I have a picture here. You need the actual driver's license. Um, if you can actually text over yeah, yeah, the picture. Yeah, yeah. Right now we have to update the electric panel. If we do, you're in luck because we cover the cost of replacing the electric panel if we have to do a 200 amp. So let's hope for an electric Who's the inspector? Is the city inspector? No, it's not the inspector. Sonoma. Okay. Yeah, Sonoma. Okay. Um, this, um, we're going to get the final design back usually in about a week and a half's time. Yep. Right? Final design is actually when you guys say, hey, I want to go ahead and proceed forward with the project. Because okay. there's no like cancellation fees or anything else like that. I'm just letting you know, I'm not going to ask for any money out of pocket, there's no down payment or anything. Perfect. Okay. okay. Thank you, so I'm going to take you out. Thank you, guys. All right. Of course. Thank you. Okay. Great to meet you. Great to meet you, too. Absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> I do my best. I'll, uh, I'll send you text as well, just so you can have my info. And then yeah, yeah, let please. us know with anyone else. So, uh, last night was exceptional. We managed to close a lead of Andres, who was actually a real estate agent, who started off the conversation by saying, yeah, I'm just gonna make sure I get three quotes. And by the end, she was not only signing up, giving us referrals, and then sent us a text message this morning that she was incredibly excited. Right now, we're gonna finish up on some documents that we needed signed from a same-day sale that I had two days back that Garrett, unfortunately, wasn't there to make. Great thing is, he's gonna be able to meet Jacqueline. We're gonna get it right now. Uh, I'll make sure you're not stepping mud on the way. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I mean, how was uh, how was last night for you? Good. Good? Yeah. Got it. And what am I looking for? Uh, an email. An yeah. Email from. Oh, I'll show you real quick. It was uh, shouldn't be. Let me pull it up real quick. Translated English. There you go. Yeah. Did she explain to you how the program works? Not not in. Like any real, no. okay. Here, I'll show you real quick. So right now she was spending like six hundred and forty something dollars a month for her electricity, and I got everything approved on our end. 
And so her new payment is $248 a month instead of $600. Okay. So we're taking care of the maintenance, monitoring, insurance, and everything else for the solar system. She's not going to get an FPL bill anymore. She yeah. just literally has the 248 bucks, and that's it. Okay. And that's what she's not spending for electricity. But I was trying to find out when yeah. I was like, we, we, we need some roofing repairs before. Well, absolutely. So I'm so with you. So, so prior to the install, we actually have, um, there's a roofer who's going to be coming out to the house. That's why we need to take care of this dock, um, because it didn't get submitted and sent back over. A roof is actually going to come out to the house to do the inspection. If we need to do any additional patchwork or, or re-roof projects done, uh, they'll let us know at that time because she already mentioned to me that you guys had 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 issues with roof leaks, right? Yes. Uh, this area where we're sitting under has is, is uh, and a few areas in the, in the back on the flat roof. Yeah. That have to be addressed before you attach anything. Of course. Yeah, yeah. 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 I mean, I'm 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 in construction. Actually, I do layout. I mean. Oh really? So so it's like I'm I'm her. trying to explain to her like. When yeah. You, yeah. You, you, you can't sign up for for some shit that they're going to attach to the roof. And oh yeah, we're, we we so so we end up warranting the system for 25 years after install. So if there's any work that needs to be done before we put up panels, we're going to do that work because we know how to. We're, yeah, we, you know, we're now responsible for the insurance for it. Yeah, that's yeah. Because it's like, I'm, how are you going to attach it into, to something that's not secure? I mean, yeah, it's built in '63, '68, yeah. something yeah. like that. And that's the original tile. That's uh, okay. Yeah, pretty much. Uh, no, uh, I think they had it done, redone in sometime in the nineties or something. But okay, it's it's yeah, it's it's old. It's, I, and it's I know old. I flew my drone over, and so the only thing we we're trying to do with her was so there's a. Uh, three billion dollars are allocated by the Department of Energy to do the Sonova projects. Right. So all we're doing is literally setting aside those funds before we do the roof work or anything else to make sure that she's a part of that program because it only allows a certain amount of houses to actually do it. Um, thankfully, she pays her bills on time and takes care of all that stuff and she's actually seeing cost savings. So there's certain neighbors where if they have too many trees right over their house, you can't do solar. Right? It doesn't cover any of their electricity bill. Um, a, a secondary thing is if they don't pay their bills on time, the Department of Energy isn't going to allocate any funds because you know they might be foreclosing on their house in five minutes. So it's just like, why are we going to bother taking care of that? And um, third is just she's spending so much on our electricity bill, to be honest, right? Yeah. $648. That's probably the latest bill. But in, 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 and when you talk so what's going to happen next? So like I was mentioning earlier, so right now, um, now we're going to be good to go because we got all the information over. So I'm, I know the areas, but I'm yeah. just saying this. I have a question for you. If it turns out we need to do a full re-roof on the house, let's just say, would you guys want to keep it tile? Yeah. See, see. Where do you want to go metal? Hmm? Where do you go metal? We can go metal. Potentially. Yeah. It's it's like she likes that tile. She loves the tile. That's, okay. that's, why, Got it. that's yeah. probably why it's you see the never been redone. See the elastomeric, she just wants to coat it. Yeah. And just try to get some things done while you're able to. Let me give you my phone number real quick too so you can, you can keep in contact. We'll, we'll get a good accounting of everything and then we'll give you guys a call and kind of figure this out. All right. Okay. See you Sounds soon. good, man. All right. Talk to you soon. Over the course, by Wednesday at the latest, um, to schedule the side inspection, they're going to go and take a look at the electric panel and everything. We might end up needing to do an electric panel upgrade because that's original and very old um, before we get anything done. And then a bit of roof work because, as mentioned earlier, obviously you've had some leaks and things like that. So we'll have a better accounting of everything and we'll get it, we'll get it sorted out. Do you ever have that moment after you sign a deal and they go, well, I got to chat with my son about it and you get a little bit worried? Well, this is basically the best possible case scenario. So I ended up chatting with the son and he was a little bit worried because his mom was a little bit older. He was so stoked about the program by the end of it, he ended up wanting to be on the actual lease agreement. So we ended up signing him up on there. He's in construction, had a fantastic conversation with them. They're gonna get installed out here in Miami roughly about three and a half weeks. We're gonna make sure we take care of their electrical, but they're gonna be in a, they're gonna be in a great, great spot. It's amazing, I think. I probably not cumulatively about three hours amount of time in Miami. We ended up getting two deals and signing roughly 39 kilowatts. This is a beautiful place to sell solar. I hope to see you guys here soon. Make sure to click the submission forms below if you are interested in changing your life by getting into the energy industry. Click subscribe. But more importantly, click one of these two videos. YouTube thinks you're gonna like it a lot.